getting ready to do the run up. The guys right now are doing some final adjustments and tweaks on the plane. Too much the difference, but the thing is that when you see the wheel. Uh -huh. The plane's basically done. It's been painted. The wings are on right now, the seats are in, the upholstery, all the finishing touches. We've just done the weight and balance, and today we are doing the first run up of the airplane, which means we're firing up the engine for the first time. It's a little overwhelming. You know, I got into this idea of plane ownership like 14 months ago, and now all of a sudden it's done. <laughs> we're firing up the airplane. So I'm very excited. I'm a little bit nervous, but let's go check out the plane. Et voila, here we are. Here is November 313 Romeo. This is my airplane. I honestly, I can't believe this. This thing is amazing. I can't believe this is my airplane and it's all done. It looks beautiful. So this is literally my first time sitting in the airplane as it's been finished. Super excited to see the panel out and be sitting in the seats for the first time. It's very comfortable. The joysticks here. If you want to take a look at these are amazing got flaps autopilot disconnect comm swap push to talk is the trigger and then there's a frequency swap right below that a little bit surreal and very exciting thank you my friend appreciate it thank you so much for everything man Woo! there we go these are my key fobs these are because it has a keyless start I just need to have this on me, like, you know, a modern day car having the key fob in your pocket. So now we've got it, let's go fire it up. What we're looking for today, obviously we're gonna pull it out, run up means we're gonna start up the engine, and then and then what? We're looking for no leaks of fuel okay. and no smoke out of the engine. All right. Except the exhaust pipes. So. Yeah, yeah. So this, 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 is a, this is a big moment. We, we built this airplane. Yeah. You built this airplane. Yeah. And it's a whole lot of components over a period of time, what, about 14 months now? It's been about 14 months yeah. since I put the down payment in. The plane arrived here six months ago. Yeah. And now yeah. here we are. This airplane has got very advanced um, avionics. And for everything to work, one of the things that has to be done before everything finally sings in unison and gives us a little symphony right. of, of, of amazing electronic um, workings yeah. is the um, magnetometer which is what in an old airplane would be a compass. This is the magnetometer that tells you which direction you fly. We've got to go out and we've got to calibrate that for the installation of the airplane and once we've done that then everything suddenly starts working and nice. so that's why it's an important thing to do now. So radio Saturday. check, taxi, magnetometer, calibration and then we'll check everything else on as we taxi back. We'll do everything except fly. Awesome. So congratulations on this moment. That Thank you. Has come. So one of the issues we identified yesterday was if you pull the brake there and you do that, it goes on because it's closed the valve, but it's, it's leaking back. So I'm going to be in charge of the brake and just holding it when we do the startup. Okay. So you can close the throttle. Okay. My old training always says, and it stuck with me through all the years, when you climb an airplane, you put the brake on and you close the throttle. Right. So if someone something goes wrong, you're not starting with the brake off and full power. Of course. Especially in a bit of a closed area. Right. Okay, well. All right. Okay, like and that. this is the moment. Yeah. Here we go. Let's that. pass you down there. All right. You've got All right. it. You're in control now, you can take the brake. All right, okay. 5 four, four. Use caution for a Cessna only short of 2 left. Cross uh, taxiway Alpha running yeah. 2 left. Clear for All takeoff right. southeast. And we're moving. Two, seven, zero, we're police one, down. Seven, go yeah, yeah. Two, seven. You can maybe favor left a little bit. Clear for takeoff southeast. Departure to approve. 5 four, four. All right, excellent. Sounds like great is working fine. Okay, watch that wing. You're good, you're very clear. Yeah. good here. Okay. Lee on the approach, 7.6 DME. Torrance ground, November 313 Romeo is at fuel pits requesting taxi to 11 left compass rows. Okay, he's good. November 313 Romeo, Torrance uh, ground, uh, what kind of aircraft are you? 
We're a, we're a sling TSI, sling four. Okay. Thanks for going on, Thank the Echo Alpha the Bravo. Echo Alpha Bravo for three one three Romeo. Yeah, good. Echo Alpha Bravo. Echo is here, yeah. Yeah. All right. Yeah. All right. So don't try and get it dropped down. It's crazy. We're heading over to the Compass Rose. Now we're clear left. We're clear right. You say Compass Rose. That's what I said. Like 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 it's a rose. What do you call it? <laughs> That's correct. Because you say it very clearly and nicely. <laughs> So, what should you do? Comp 2's not on. Let's see. Right, go to the VPX? Exactly. Right. I'm not going to deal with that right now while I'm taxing, though. Yeah, let me just see. Go to the radio check. Okay. Test, test. All right, cool, man. So, we had a nice, nice run up. We went over to calibrate the magnetometer, kind of go over a few settings. Um, you know, let the computer know that uh, we're an airplane that wants to go fly and do things. And uh, what else, Sean? Yeah, well, I think it's pretty good. I think uh, it's ready to fly. We just need to put some wing bolts in and go. Yeah. So there you have it, guys. We had an incredibly successful run up today. The plane is basically finished. The next step is we actually have to take the wings off and put it on a truck to send the plane out to French Valley Airport because that's where we do the fly-off. Because it's an experimental aircraft, we have to do the fly-off in kind of a non-urban area. And uh, so we'll see you next time for the first flight. Hey guys, if you liked the video, don't forget to like and subscribe to Richard in the Sky. Thanks so much.